We are on Barry Island doing my infuse experiment. So this infuse experiment is linked to a bigger project that I'm doing called the Barry Wayfinding Project, which is a new pedestrian signage project for Barry. And so this experiment was to engage with people about what, what content should be there. You know, what do they want to say about Barry Island to visitors or what do they, what information would they find useful as a resident of Barry? Over the years I've done quite a few um, public engagement act type activities but I've also done some consultation events. I found sort of anecdotally that consultation events tend to um, attract a similar demographic, you know, people who are retired, people who have more time on their hands and I felt there were a lot of other demographics that not, we're not reaching. If we could have some activities targeted at different demographics that are less common to see at consultation events that we, we would hear you know different voices and get, get different perspectives so you attract people to take part because it's an interesting activity and then you do the consultation kind of on the side in between and you get their feedback then. Today, my target audience, as it were, were parents with very young children. This demographic, you, you, you wouldn't normally see at a consultation event because they they're too busy. This event was a creative storytelling walk around Barry Island and on the walk we were able to talk to parents. I was able to see how they interact with the place, how the children interact, what, you know, what activities they, they were enjoying but I introduced the Barry Wayfinding project right at the beginning, that was my introduction, and I explained that I would be um, talking to them and trying to get tips from them about what they found most interesting about the island. And then right at the end, I had a, a very, very short survey of questions. As council staff, we, we do have to take responsibility for engaging in a way that everybody gets a chance to feedback. And if they don't, then you just need to try harder. <laughs> the Infuse experiment meant that I had permission in a way to do this project and to do this experiment and be able to then show, look, this, this worked. Um, we've engaged with people that we wouldn't normally have engaged with and so we should do more of this. So I think for me that's a real big positive.